Well, we had a soggy start to the day today, or end of the day today, but because of those showers that we had, we could have some pockets of some dense fog later on tonight into early tomorrow. So if you do come across these po uh, foggy patches, make sure you slow down and use caution. Then we do have some more rain heading into our area late Sunday night into Monday morning, though. I'll have a little bit more on that in just a little bit. Tonight, temperatures, though, are into the 20s, 29 degrees, and we're finally drying out after those showers made their way across the, uh, the region for tonight. Now, mostly cloudy skies overall. Now, our next Next chance of seeing any rain and precipitation is still way off to the east, I mean over to the west, over in parts of New Mexico and Arizona. It's a very fast moving system that's going to be bringing widespread rain and the chance for some thunderstorms into late Sunday night into Monday morning. So we'll be having those dry start for tomorrow with temperatures into the 40s, 44 degrees by noontime and then those clouds start moving their way in by 4 p.m. right as you're if you're heading to the um, Hot Wheels event that is taking place downtown Rockford. It will be starting to get some cloudy, cloudy skies and then eventually as you're leaving the event, it will be a little bit of some showers. So make sure you grab an umbrella before you head out. Like I mentioned, we see some showery activity move into the area late afternoon, very scattered in nature and very drizzly to start. And then we have those more widespread showers moving in heavier at times right around the four o'clock hour, which is right around when that um, Hot Wheels event gets out. So make sure you're grabbing an umbrella and a rain jacket if you're heading to that before you go. We do get heavier rain showers in closer to the evening hours right around 10 o'clock and then even into the 11 o'clock and 1 o'clock hour for Monday morning. We could have a few rumbles of thunder for the early morning hours. Now for Sunday though, temperatures still remain warm 47 degrees with mostly cloudy skies and those showers into the afternoon. Those showers continue into the day for Monday morning scattered at most and could see the pockets of heavy rain in the morning and then gradually getting drier as the day goes on. Again, it would dry out right around the morning commute and then we have those pockets of some drizzly conditions overall by the late morning hours and then have some uh, dry or conditions dry out by the afternoon and evening hours. Now we do get rather warm for the next couple of days, 55 by Monday for your most accurate 10 day forecast. We see those temperatures drop back down into the 30s. Sam, back over to you. All right, so have those umbrellas on standby. Kelsey, 